Good morning, chicks and chickens. Welcome back to Old Man Farm. My name is Sid, as always. Check our fortune. Though, <laughs> I don't know that it's gonna matter. Good humor. Maybe we'll make it matter. Oh, you know what? I didn't even see what our uh, requested dish was today. We got some mail. Hi, Sid. Thanks for the eggs. The yolks look amazing. I think this will be my best omelet yet. Please accept this gift. Gus, a mini fridge? What? That is bonkers. I didn't know that was a thing. That's cool. Let's pop that down there. Well, you know what that means. Uh, all of these finished products that I have just been storing, they're going in here. That's cool. Yeah, I didn't know that was, uh, I didn't know we were going to get that. It's very exciting. Okay. Now, I was given a uh, little, little tip about um, those fish, both the lingcod and the albacore, we are gonna need later. So we're gonna hold on to those for now. Let's see, I've got an unusual request. Could you keep this a secret? I want you to del deliver an amethyst to Emily. It's her favorite stone. Tell her it's from me. Uh, yeah, we can, we can play little Cupid. I'm into that. Let's see, we have an amethyst, right? Yeah. Okay, uh, that's cool. We have to go by Clint's anyway, so. Hi, puppies. Okay, well, let's go uh, handle the chickens and the cows. And then we'll get on with our day. Oh, and yep, check our crab pots like I always forget to do. Oh, do we have a... Looks like we have a broken post here. Sure do. Well, that's not really a big deal because the animals aren't going to be coming out. But uh, hello, who are you? Moolah. Luna. Melissa, oops, and Badonker. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. So I made a post in the Discord uh, yesterday. Uh, yes, link in the description to my Discord if you'd like to come and join us. I said, still small, trying to get some stuff together so that we can get some proper um, hangouts going on in there, uh, movie nights, game nights. And uh, lots of pictures of my dog sleeping in awkward positions. That's that's a lot. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I mentioned something in there uh, about a game that was on its uh, in the Steam. Oh, uh, excuse me, the Steam Summer Sale. Uh, it is called um, Monster Sanctuary. It's a little Metroidvania indie game, right? Um, but it, uh, my brother came over, whoops, I forgot an egg. My brother came over yesterday, and we, uh, were going to, or he, he was telling me, he's like, hey, I saw this game on the summer sale, and I immediately made you, me think of you, because I, I play a lot of games that, you know, look like this. Um, I like, uh, I like 2D pixel art uh, games. I'm just, I'm, I'm really into that, always have been. And uh, he was like, yeah, this game looks like something you'd be into. And I look at it, and sure enough, it's already on my wish list. Um, <laughs> so it was like six bucks or something. I picked it up. And uh, yeah, it's definitely worth every penny. It is sort of a, it's a, it's a Metroidvania, but you go around and you don't like Pokemon style capture monsters, but there is a an element of that to it. You fight monsters and there's a chance they'll drop eggs, then you hatch the eggs, and then you, you know, train them and use them to fight. But you have a party of Oh, we have the quarry now. We'll have to go check that out. Uh but you have a party of monsters, right? Uh you can have a bunch in your inventory, so to speak. Nice steel watering can. That's nice. Uh, let's process a geode. But um, you can have three out on the field fighting at once. So, yeah, it's it's um, it's legitimately a pretty cool game. And uh, my brother and I, we had all these multiplayer things we were going to play. We both ended up just sitting next to each other playing that game. It was a lot of fun. Okay, let's donate that severed hand or whatever it's called. Uh, down here. Okay. Nada. Still nothing. Okay, so, we need to find Emily. Who are you? Is that Harvey? Yeah! Today's my day off, but I figure I shouldn't stay cooped up all day. He looks very warm. 
Okay, so we have to find... Okay, Emily will be at the star drop. We'll go and find her, but... I want to go find Willy and turn in this... Squid. We have to... Uh, sort out our to-do list at some point as well. Hey, little shrimpy! I think... I believe... We can finish off that, uh... That quest board. Oh, man, he's not in here. You up in your house? Your room, rather? No. Can't go in the back yet. Well? Willy's Wonderland, where are you? Have you ever seen the movie Willy's Wonderland? Uh... Surprisingly love that movie. I, I accept that it's terrible. I don't care. I love it. Um, okay, well, I don't see our boy. It's too early to go to the saloon so i think what we're gonna do just because i want to check it out i want to go to the quarry real fast and then we'll probably walk back and go by the community center or we'll do that later tonight i'm not really sure but i want to go check out the quarry because in sve I, I don't know what to expect here looks pretty much the same but we do have some good ore deposits here we can get in and get around to now I have never gotten into the, the ins and outs of, um, sort of, what do you want to say, um, I don't want to say exploiting, but I know there's, like, ways to really maximize what you get out of the quarry. I know nothing about that. So, um, if you know anything about that, uh, let me know, just because, or link me an article or something, or better yet, just join the Discord and come talk to me. But, uh, link in the description. Uh, <laughs> But I, 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 like I said, I never really used this. It's, it's very much a, a passive thing for me, for the quarry. But I, I would love to know more. Oh, we got a level up. Mining level up. It's nice. But I am just going to sit here and try and get the more, um, the rarer things here. You know, our, uh, our golds and gems and the few iridium we had the uh, capability of getting. Uh, and there's a little cave over here. I don't know what this is all about. Let's check that out. Oh. Oh, crap. This is the Skull Dungeon. Okay. Right? Let's see if this stuff is way beyond our level. Well, I won't say way beyond, but it's definitely strong. We'll, we'll brave a floor or two, right? What was that sound? Oh my god. I actually jumped in real life. <laughs> that got me. Okay, well. Whoa. What are you? Okay, nice. Ooh, a ring. What's it do? Increases critical strike chance. I feel like we already have that. Yeah, we do. No, don't you dare bump at me. Okay. May as well start doing a little swing in here. See if we can't find a way out. Um, I believe this is what they refer to as the Skull Dungeon, right? I could be mistaken on that. Um, but I believe that's what this is. And again, this is another thing. I don't know what the real purpose of this is. If it's just a, you know, a, another more difficult dungeon, perhaps? Jesus, get beat up. Well, so far nothing in here is ter- I mean, this is only floor one, but nothing is terribly difficult. And... Yeah. These guys are a little spooky, but... They're not too hateful. Oh, we got a full inventory already, damn. Well, I- t in my defense, I did not intend to come down here. Um... Let's see if we can find an end to it. Wow, a lot of these guys. Oh, crap. Ah, crap. I swear we hit him. Oh, no. Oh, we got this. Come on. Not too bad, not too bad. Oh, wait, maybe this isn't the Skull Dungeon, because what's this guy? Oh, wait, now I remember this. Okay. Uh, what are we going to do? Dump. Dump the single muscle. How about that? We get the golden scythe from this. Ah, uh, cool. Whoa. Okay. Um, 
We're just gonna move on with our life. <laughs> oh, that was that was an interesting encounter. Now, I'm assuming that's just a normal scythe, right? Yeah. It well, it says it's more powerful than a normal scythe, but what I don't get about that is, that doesn't the normal scythe just take down plants in one hit? I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something. If you know, let me know. But yeah, there we go. That makes me think that uh, what I was referring to as the Skull Dungeon is probably not that. Uh, oh, uh, well, we want that. We'll ditch an egg. What do we have? We have... That's just a silver quality egg. We'll... Again, though, I guess I could have eaten that, but whatever. No big deal. I There is a mod that adds another backpack... Uh, like a fourth level to your backpack, and I th but I think it's like 50 grand. Um, might be worth looking into, quite honestly. I do get just kind of sick of always being out of inventory space, but I guess also we have drastically mismanaged uh, today. This is really my fault, if we're being honest. Okay, crab pot bundle. Oh, well, we only needed one thing, and that's good because... Let's see, let's keep the shrimp and put the snail in so we make use of that river. Hooray! What do we get? Another crab pot. Well, that's that checks out. So, let's see. That's just friendship. So this is what unlocks the ability to go to the desert, right? Okay. So, wow, you need a lot of money. What is that? 30, 40, 42 and a half thousand. Uh, we can make that happen, but uh, not right now. But... We won't be able to get our greenhouse until we get that handled, so I do I do need to work on that. That's that's up there. But for now, let's go see if we can talk to Willie and um, Emily. Oh, we have an event. Well, there's Willie. Well, folks, once again, we're gathered for a very special occasion. A rare visit from a very dear friend. It is a massive omelet, my world-famous giant omelet. Zesty bell pepper, juicy tomato, rich mushroom, and tangy cheese, all enrobed in a blanket of rich, fluffy egg. Dig in, folks. That sounds good. I made a bomb breakfast this morning since my brother stayed the night. Willie, what do you think? Hmm. The mushrooms are a tad chewier than last year. Is that a good thing? Oh, he looks so heartbroken. Aye, lad. <laughs> See, he is a pirate. It's great, Gus, and it tastes even better because it's on the house. Oh, Pam. These eggs are so rich and yellow. Marnie, are these from your place? <laughs> nope. You can thank Sid over at Old Man Farm. Mmm, old man eggs. <laughs> Yum. Well, that was awesome. Uh, okay, Emily. Here you go. This gift is fabulous. Thank you so much. Uh, but I was supposed to say it was from Clint. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, Shane. I'm renting my room for Marnie. Yeah, we know that. Okay, let's see. What do you like? Um, I think he loves eggs, right? From his head down to his legs. No, he just likes them. That's okay. There you go. It's a great gift. Thanks. You're welcome. I was really hoping we'd see Willie here. Maybe he'll show up a little later. A lot of the adult crowd isn't here yet. Um, Andy? This ain't that bad. Thank you kindly for the gift. I like that jacket, my man. Leah? Hey, how's your day going? Pretty good. No, I'm not going to ask you to follow me. What do you like? You like eggs? Corn? I have a corn. It's a really nice gift. Thank you. You're very welcome. Marnie! My lady, here, you want a jade? How about it? Thank you. You're welcome. And you know what? Because I... am that guy. Let's buy a beer for Pam. Hey now, this is for something. This is really something. Thanks a million, kid. You're welcome, Marnie. Gotta look after the, the town drunk now that Shane and I are sobering up. Hey, Willie! If you see me out fishing... You just come up beside me and cast your line, too. You're always welcome to. Well, thanks. Have a squid. Hey, you did it. Oh, excuse me. All right, you did it. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'm impressed. 
Winter's a good time to break out the fishing rod, isn't it? I'm gonna go with aren't it? Ain't ye? Land lover, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> so, here's the thing. Oh shit, I gave Emily that ruby. I did not give her the amethyst. <sighs> Whoops, that's good though, that's good. I, I don't mind getting some hearts with her, but here you go. Oh, my favorite stone, you're so sweet. Huh, it's from who? Oh, you got it at Clint's? Well, I don't care where you got it from. It's beautiful. Thank you. And she kissed me. Oh, no. Oh, do you know how to cook bean hot pot? No, and I feel really bad. Damn it. And I like Clint, too. Oh, I feel so bad. Who are you? Sebastian. The frogs aren't very happy in the winter. Well, poor little guys. That's fair. I mean, can you blame them? Can you blame them, sea bass? I want to make all sort of Animal Crossing style puns about your name. All right, let's head home. Take care of the the whatnots and the howdy do's. Now I do want to check something because I don't know is the iron one enough? Nope. Well, yeah, I guess technically all you need is the three. But I really want to get the gold can so we can water um, a 3x3 three three at a time. So we need to save up. Do we have any gold? We have four. So we'll have enough by tomorrow. I don't think he's open tomorrow. But if he is, yeah, we'll go handle that. Uh, we have enough to make a single iridium bar. Not terribly worthwhile, but it exists. And we don't look gift horses in the mouth around these parts. Did I sell anything? No, but we're going to go and grab some mayo, so not a problem. All good in the hood. That's, I, I don't, what was, was that Spock trying to be hip? I don't know. Ah, crap. Yeah, we're just going to tear down this fence for now. Actually, you know what we're going to do? We'll make it stone. Um, I did see that there is a, there is a setting that you can change so that, um, uh, boop bop, beep bop, did em, dad em, wad em, chew, so that you can, uh, <laughs> um, make it so that that fence is, uh, I don't know if it's either removable or it just removes it. I'm not sure, but, uh, if it makes it removable, I would be interested in maybe doing that. But if it makes it just full-blown removed, uh, I don't want to do that. Now, I'm going to leave this open, but I am going to make a spot on our to-do list that says, like, end of winter, right? Actually, no. I'm going to set a reminder. Let's, why don't we use our apps properly here? There we go. Sell that mayo. What else did I have to do? Okay, we do have these crab pots. I guess I may as well. Yeah, whatever. We'll go set them up, because I didn't check those anyway, so. Uh, what was I doing over here? Doot, doot, doot. That's what I was putting away. Okay, we'll go ahead and set these crab pots up in our river. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pick this one up, and I'm going to put it near our chicken coop, so that we actually will see it uh, most days. There we go. I think that's honestly going to be more beneficial for us. Uh, and you know what? While things aren't going to be growing back, maybe tomorrow we do like a big old bunch of clear cutting. You know what I mean? Yeah, we'll do a big old bunch of clear cutting and sort of try and get the farm in order. But let's go ahead and get back to our house. Warm up by the fire a little bit. And I'm going to hold on to this shrimp because I want to take him to the aquarium, which, uh, again, we'll try and get there when we can. I I know we're really, really running behind on that, but I just, you know, I don't know. I don't know what else to do. We've It's it's not a super high priority as much as I love it. It's not a priority to get there since we are literally on no time limit for it. What's the weather looking like tomorrow? Beautiful sunny day. Sounds good to me. Throw this corn back in here. I don't need that anymore. We've got a few things to put away. We'll get get poke a pet before we go. Oh right, we have our loom was finished. 
Uh, we'll throw that ring in there. I'm gonna throw the extra scythe in there. Okay, now I'm gonna do a little arranging real quick. I'm gonna take that. I don't need this. Put this next to that. Okay, that's good enough. That's good enough for my purposes. Okay, now let's go ahead and use that weird app we have. Okay, so on summer 28, we are going to have the message um, build fence. Okay. Wait. I put an S. Did you see that? That was wonderful. Okay, and we'll make that go off at, yeah, we'll just go with 8.30 a.m. May as well. Um, and you know what? Real quick, though, I do want to check because I feel like we had some reminders. I thought one was supposed to go off today. It's tomorrow. Tomorrow's Caroline's B Day. Okay. Well, that sounds good. Uh, speaking of, though, real quick, let's go ahead and adjust our to-do list. We've got do not sell eggs is fine. Buy sprinkler no longer matters. And check crab pot is not really something we need to worry about. So I think we're good on that as well. Okay. Well, that was a nice day. I had a really good day today. I hope you did too. I just, I don't know. I've been in a funk the last couple weeks and I, I don't know. I'm feeling a little better today. So thank you guys for sticking around. I really do appreciate it. I'm glad to see you guys comments, all those things. And go, go check out the discord for real. I, I, I have plans for that that I want to, we just need a few more people in there to start getting it working. But um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Be good to each other. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Good night.